All right, so check this out. I just picked up this new Kawasaki side-by-side. -side. This is like a sport model. This video will cover my experiences with this thing over the first few months of owning it. So taking it out on a few rides, I want to do a few modifications to it right away. Just, just adding accessories like uh, bumper, mud flaps, probably going to want a windshield and a roof. Kind of feel like it should have had a tailgate on it, so we'll add that. I want to add a tow hitch to it. So, uh, but let's uh, take this thing out and see what it's all about. I went up some crazy hills and pretty much you can do anything you want to do as fast as you want. Uh, but I did notice it needs a few accessories. Would have been cool to have a roof. Fender flares. We got a tailgate for it. Got a tow hitch. So let's do a few little things to it now. So working on this tailgate, they got to bolt in these brackets. Don't over tighten those because they break. Had to weld that one back together. Right. Well, that's cool. Then you can actually put stuff in this bed. Not, 
new bolts installed. That's how you gotta pull that across. Look! Look how! Look at that! I'm bol bolting that. Look how much the wheel. Look at that. All right. I got this side back where it needs to be. All right, I got it. All right, here's the trick. If you are taking, if you're doing this job, don't, don't, like, slip another bolt in from the back or something to not lose the position of those. Every vehicle has to have a trailer hitch. It's code. Yeah. Bro, you want water? All right, this guy's having a little bit too much fun today. Came around that turn, and he hit that tree pretty good. And it took him a few minutes to get up and walk it off. All right, Cody. At least it ain't boring, is it? All right. After ride number two, yeah, that was fun. Let's um, let's finish putting this stuff on this thing, though. Here, I got the. Fenders, the roof, the windshield. I may hold off on the windshield. I got the bumper. That's cool. It's got a see through section. Look at that. Oh, that is nice. I was almost going to put like a piece of diamond plate up there, but how much, look how much nicer that is. And that's the roof with a skylight. That's nice. I guess that's cool. Uh, this goes right there.
So that's on there. Actually, there's more than this coming. I got a tow hook coming for here and a brush guard for the headlights, but you know, that's, that's pretty solid. You know, you could definitely push some stuff out of the way. I don't know about ramming stuff with it, but definitely glad that's on there. All right, this thing kind of throws mud all over itself. So I got these. Right, this screw here, this just is turning. I think a nut broke off inside that frame. So I. Yeah, see, that's just. See if we can get that in there. It's kind of at a weird angle here. Oh yeah. So here's the difference between the wider ones and the factory ones. So the idea here is to, the vehicle shouldn't throw mud all over itself. That looks, that looks like that should work. I mean, that'll definitely help a lot. All right, let's do the other side. Pretty solid. I think should have just came like that. That's how they get you. Is they sell this thing, and then there's like all these accessories that are kind of like, are they accessories or do you need these things? Oh well. All right. Well, that's looking cool. Yeah, drive over that. It's a good 
have two cars next to each other. We can drive over them. <laughs> That's a brand new Dude. Just pretty unstoppable.
start, she's gonna go like that. Oh. I didn't That's gonna cut, that's gonna yeah. cut that. So can you go and, I mean. Trust that? I don't know, maybe we'll see what happens. good timing there this guy was in a bit of a bind Yeah, well, almost. Dude, that tree right there. Got me. Almost. Dude, I almost made it up this. If this tree wasn't here, I would have made it. But I think I need a winch. This girl's not afraid of anything. Look how steep this is. Now the problem is I gotta get up there to winch you up. Right? Yeah, I can't go backwards because I'm running into a tree. Wait, where are we? Like, is this the trail? I don't know. I think this is definitely not the trail. Oh. Well, I'm having a good time, Tom. That is definitely right I thought you were... winch in the front? Nah, if I had a winch, I'd be all right. If this tree wasn't here, that tree almost flipped me over. Because my tire, like, ran off. I can't believe how stable this thing is. Like... I know, I didn't tip at all. Like, I, like, drove up this tree, and it just bounced over there. Although, I was kind of wanting to see her face reaction. She does She's not... This girl doesn't realize the danger. I can't even stand up without... She doesn't ball. realize what danger she's in. Yeah. Like... <laughs> No, I didn't get a tip over. That thing is like unflippable. <laughs> like, this, uh, I hope you get a shot of that right there. Like, is it just 30 degrees? It's a number. Yo, I'm gonna take Okay, so I'm over there. This is the trail. Now I'm realizing. I was like, there's a shortcut. That's that's the problem. Right there. I need a chainsaw. I got this little handsaw. I've
Next to the trail, kinda. On the, look, the tow, tow strap. Oh, right there. That's so yeah. Yeah, I got it. I got this. Thank you. Alright, last time I was out riding towards the end of the day when it got dark out, it started getting cold. I had this windshield sitting here for a couple weeks. Finally got a chance to put it on and it was way warmer. But as I was installing this thing, like it had some something on it. I rubbed it with my sweatshirt. It was like dusty and it just scratched it like crazy. And I rubbed the other side. Both sides of this thing got completely scratched before even riding it. So um, they... So they had a one year warranty on this. I'm sending this right back. That's junk. And I ordered a new one. I ordered the glass one. Let's see how that turns out. All right, if you're gonna buy one of these, plan on spending a lot of money on it because like you, you get it and it's like, oh, this thing's cool. They, they know, they send you this accessory book and you start looking through it and realizing you need a lot of these accessories. So, ah, <laughs> oh, there's one I haven't ordered yet. Look at that back bumper. Winch, all right, so we got a winch. After last time, after, if I had a winch, I wouldn't have been stuck. What else? It looks nice, the blue. Look at that light bar. This, the headlights on this thing are plenty bright though. Got the tailgate. Well, let's just keep bolting on accessories. Right? You excited? And we got uh, this is a glass windshield. Alright, this is this glass instead of plastic. And it's the Kawasaki brand. All right, that looks nice. And at least it's actual glass. So like, that's what I did to the last one. And like, it just was so scratched from doing that. They sell a windshield wiper kit for this. That's kind of tempting too. Look at that, that is nice. Check out this new chain, so I just got two. The top handle, I think it's so it's a lot smaller. It's easier to bring with you. Um, I mean, it's easy to bring a chainsaw on this thing. It's, this is big, but like I could bring that snowmobiling and stuff too. I also, you know, that's the real deal. There, I ordered a set of dogs for it. Um, I also ordered this guy. This was like 80 bucks. This thing. It was the smallest chainsaw I could find. Look at the look at the bar on that thing. It's like a toy. Um, but this thing's a little bit too toyish. This would be good for like a little kid or something. All right. Bring in the real deal. All right, Cody. Yeah. Something else. Let's just take tools. Allen had. I like that. Cody, I'm curious how fast you can run. And I think we have a, a pretty good way to gauge that because this has a speedometer and you like to run next to it. Five, twenty 
there, buddy. 26, that's fast. This windshield is nice. You know, I mean, there's like no wind in this thing. Look at that butterfly. doing all right so this thing's got 300 miles on it now i figure it's time for an oil change looks pretty easy to do let's put it up on the lift to do it 
Is this thing still tight? Oh yeah. Yeah, see that's when they get loose, you'd be like click, 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 click. Anytime you put anything up on a lift, check it like that. All right. Let's see. There's the oil comes out right there. That oil still looks clean, look at that. How's the rest of this thing? So that's plastic plate here, metal under the operators. It's got some bends in it, but I don't think it'll get much worse than that. Cut the entire bottom of this thing is just completely flat. Got my helpers there. Hey guys. And today is Cody's birthday. He is one. All right, you're one years old today. And you are 14 in five months. Looks like someone's coming. Let's see who it is. Anyone cool? <laughs> Cody's gonna go get him. Cody, don't chase that kid. Come on. Hundred ninety two miles. Let's put the date to so eleven twenty. That. There.
like. I don't like how this back tire is going to be on nothing. I don't like that either. Yeah, dude, that back tire is going right off the ledge. Yeah, what if I just floor? It's a, yeah, you'll be all right, just because you got the suspension travel. I'll hook a strap to that tree so you don't flip over. Well, now you're off of it and you didn't flip over, so you might as well keep going. You're good, keep coming, keep coming. Now you're gonna drop. Good. Get behind the street. That that your wheel's gonna drop again. <sighs> See, but now you gotta go back over that on the way back. Unless we figure out a way down. I mean, actually, we could just go that way. You can go that way. I'll do that way. Yeah, you could do that way. Yeah, I mean, yeah. I thought we were there. No, this goes like old. This is like the furthest. I'll keep going. I haven't had an issue. High to stop going trail on this whole mountain. But okay. it gets impossible. Well, it's it's cool. Like, it's just really hard. This is a trail, I promise it's a trail. It's just really, really hard.
Everybody. All right, well, I'm gonna kind of end this video now. This covers about the first four months of owning this thing. I've certainly ridden it a lot of times and not bothered, you know, filming anything, but I tried to capture all the highlights and stuff. So, um, so I'm gonna end this video and I'm gonna make another one kind of filmed in the same format where I take off from right here, maybe covering the next six months or a year of owning the thing, any work done to it and any of the highlights of riding it. I still have a winch I wouldn't put on it. I may put a new set of tires on it because I did get a flat the other day, um, but I was doing something that d deserved it. But uh, but this thing, it's I mean, that's got 3115s on it. That's a truck tire. This thing could probably get like a set of Super Swampers, probably even go a little bit bigger. But being that it's a 15 inch rim, that makes the tires super cheap and easy to get, so. All right, well, this thing's been a ton of fun. Haven't had any trouble with it, other than a flat. And uh, looking forward to keeping this thing around. This thing is a blast. And the other thing I want to do to it, you can get this, you can get plates for these and make it road legal. That's something I want to probably pursue too. You got to jump through a bunch of hoops to do it, but that would be super cool to do. I did actually get this other side by side that's road legal. I'm kind of comparing it to this and it's it's nowhere near what this thing is. This thing is performance wise with the suspension this thing has. This thing is absolutely ridiculous. It's been just a blast to ride. So, all right, well, look forward to that video.